and we want it to be beautiful and lush and romantic, just like a Nancy Myers movie. She's our favorite director. Aw, I love You've Got Mail. That's Nora Ephron, you idiot. I know. Hey, I saw you earlier. You weren't in the bathroom. You were on a park bench playing on your phone. Yeah, you left me to do everything while I thought you were pooping. I wish you were pooping. I wish to God. I'm sorry. Oh, Rosa, crying. Don't know what to do. Pat, Pat, this feels wrong. We put away figures three weeks ago. Mento should have been back by now. We had plans to meet on that park bench once the coast was clear. But he hasn't shown up. Maybe he's deep undercover, or he doesn't remember who he is, or maybe he's dead. Wow, thanks. You're right, my fiance is a total weirdo who's probably dead. I'll just give up on him and go do my paperwork. No, Diaz, wait, maybe he's just really, really injured. Come on, Amy. I've only had Arlo for a day and a half. But if anything happened to him, I would kill everyone in this room and then myself. Very violent eulogy, I like it. Charles, I'm sorry. You don't have to get over it. Take as long as you want. I want to apologize for yesterday. Inserting myself into my employee's breakup with my nephew somehow uh, backfired. It's not your fault. I'm the one that made a scene like a dumb crying baby. I'm considering having my tear ducts melted shut. It's not the end of the world to feel things. I guess not. It's up there. The thing is, I really cared about Marcus, but he wanted to get married, and I'm just not ready for that. And if I'm not ready with a guy as great as Marcus, then what if I'm never ready? What if that was it, my one chance of love? And what if I never get a second chance? I don't know. I'm just, I'm just sad. Well, I, I understand. Must be very difficult. Wait, are you crying? Yes. Thank you for acknowledging my feelings. Thank you for acknowledging mine. We're both great at this. <laughs> I'm going to the dumb party, but only because I don't want to hurt Marcus. I'm still super mad at you. Mm, like how you still super mad at Gilmore Girls for how the finale went down? I just want to see Lorelai happy. No, I can't do it. What? I thought you wanted us to change you. I thought I did too, but I don't. I like having emotions, okay? This is who I am. You're leaving, and that's a really big change, and I'm gonna cry about it a lot, okay? And there it is, another flawless Gina moment. What? What's going on? Amy, the lesson I wanted to leave you with is to just be yourself. If you wanna cry like an idiot for hours on end, just do it. You wanna make a big old ugly book full of all my brilliant thoughts, do it. Do you? Thanks, Gina. Oh, wow. That was really, really sweet. Oh, dip. I got Rosa to feel her feelings, too. Inadvertent Gina moment. Two for one. <gasps> Come in, my babies. Come in. What are you doing here? I wanted to say I'm sorry. I reacted poorly last night. This is all new to me. I know. But it's also not new, you know. I'm still the same person I always was. But I don't feel I know that person. Dad. My fault, not yours. I want you to be able to tell me everything. I can't promise you I'll understand. But I'm trying. I want you to know that I accept you for who you are. And I love you very, very much. I love you too. So, Diaz, I figured out why you want to win. I hacked your work calendar. Those calendars are public. Everyone on the system has access. I hacked it. I'm a hacker. Anyhow, you took a vacation 14 days ago, and yet you already want another day off? Odd, unless you need it for a unique, once-in-a-lifetime occurrence. Perhaps a proposal to your girlfriend, Jocelyn? What? You've been dating for a year, you met each other's parents, and you just got your nails done to present her with a ring. Jocelyn broke up with me. What? I want the day off so I can sit alone, listen to death metal, and get my head right. But what about my nail polish solve? Getting my nails done made me feel better for a second. Uh, this is a trick to throw me off. I bet things are better than ever. And you, oh, you really are crying. Welcome 
to my most sadistic creation, the tangled nightmare of extension cords that lives in our supply closet. Your mission is to untangle your lamp's cord, plug it in, and then pull yourself to it on your dolly and turn it on. Oh, nice. Hitchcock's coming down from the speed. I have a chance. Freaks, begin! the top one and yank the bottom one. Oh, thank God that's what you meant. Although I'm open to whatever you want to try. Here we go. Diaz, I want to apologize. I'm not talking to you. Oh, oh, Amy, it worked. The pegging worked. What? No. Here we go. Oh. Gotcha. You're never going to catch me. Oh, yeah. Yes. I did it. And Hitchcock's gonna lose! Rosa and Holter are gonna beat him! Rosa, stop! I give up. I want you to know, I'm sorry for prying. Win this thing and enjoy your day off. And if you ever want a friend to sit with you and silently listen to death metal, just know, I'm always here. Okay. I'd like that. Diaz, you should be very proud of yourself. I know things aren't exactly where you want to be right now, but uh, I promise you they will improve. Thank you, Captain. Every time someone steps up and says who they are, the world becomes a better, more interesting place. So, thank you. Five, six, seven, eight. Eyes up, shoulders down. Well, that wasn't terrible. See, Sarge? Tough love works. Oh, here he comes. Oh, man. Bolt cutters. Bolt cutters have literally never been used by an innocent person. I use them all the time when I make jewelry. What? Oh, my god. Follow-up questions later. I shouldn't gram so much, but my brunch friends say it's the only way to promote my handmade jewelry line. Brunch? What? Homemade coo- what? Brunch? Charles, focus. All right, Gina. We have to act soon. That cold medicine Diaz chugged, it was the non-drowsy kind. She's all over the place. Hey! Hey, 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 guess what? Yeah, I got a new lead to ask my perv about as a drug dealer on State Street. Whoa! Why doesn't someone answer that phone? Get it, I will get it. Hello? No, there's no Michael here. You have the wrong number. Goodbye. I'm Michael. That's a dumb name, but it's yours, and you should be proud of it because you are the greatest detective I've ever known. No doy, Diaz. No doy. Where is my file? Yeah. She's so hopped up on that stuff, her brain's gonna blow. I'm gonna interrogate the perp. You keep Diaz occupied. I don't want to get near her germ face. Permission to lock her in a distant room? No. Just distract her. Yes. That is what I will do. Rosa. Tell you something, it's a secret. Okay, but I have a lot of stuff to do. It's a secret. Start it's by doing it. It's a secret. Oh, Here it is. See? Let me out of here. <laughs> Everything okay with Diaz? Yeah, she fell asleep five minutes after I locked her in, and she hasn't moved in the past 10 hours. She talks in her sleep. I'm gonna rip your head off. I'm gonna rip your damn head off, Grandma. Oh, Terror Bear, what if she sleeps forever? <laughs> oh, 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 God. You look great, girl. I gotta get out of here. Bye. You better not run, because I will catch you after I'm done crushing that perp you are next. I already interrogated the perp for you. You what? I got him to name his Giggle Pig supplier. It's all good. Now go home and get better. I could have done it myself. No, you couldn't have. You literally have been in a coma since yesterday. Now, I know you like to act like you don't need any help, but we all do. Look, I asked five dudes to spot me when I'm doing my squats. Terry paid me $20 to lock you up. No, I did not. But I took that cheddar and I made you this special Rosa's gonna make this called her bitch care package. Now's the time when you say thank you for all your help. Thank you for all your help. Wait, is that a smile I see? Possibly. My immune system is too weak to fight off my small muscles. Um, I just wanted to thank you for all your help yesterday. I didn't do much. It was nothing. Good day. What's going on? Just very busy. Get back to work. Wait, what do you have in there? A balloon arch. Oh, my God, Captain. She is magnificent. Vindication! <laughs>